What's good, YouTube? All knowing, all loving, all feeling, all powerful, just damn all everything. Sexy as hell host, Life Games Channel, Lamont Tyson. We're going to take y'all in the gym today to do some that. But first, we want to talk about your motivations and your goals. And in that regard, we're all chasing some form of fitness goal, whether you want to do a marathon, whether you want to do a fitness competition, whether you just want to be in better health for your family. My ode to you is the foundation for everybody's fitness quest is what are you putting in your body to fuel it? That's the foundation for every fitness quest. You can't get great results unless you're eating good food. And so whatever it is that is motivating you guys and inspiring you guys to get up and do what you do every day on your fitness goals, I want you to think about that at that moment, at your weakest moment, when you want to go eat some cake, when you want to go eat some ice cream, it's crunch time and your brain is just telling you, go eat sugar. I want you to think about what is motivating you to get through and let that get you through those time periods. I mean, I just had that incident last night with my wife. This chick go to the kitchen and get some pumpkin spice cake. I don't know where she got it from because it won't in the refrigerator. And next thing I know, she don't watch the presidential debate. I don't know if she got upset, got stressed, or what happened. But next thing I know, I'm smelling pumpkin spice. And my brain is like, get you some of it. And I had to think about my goals. And I said no. So my motivation to you guys is whatever is pushing you on your quest, when that dark moment comes, think about that goal. Think about that outcome. And um, before we train, let me sing. This song is dedicated to my wife and her behavior last night. <clears throat> if you think you're lonely now, ooh yeah, bring some more cake in bed. You'll be holding on to that plate. And I think I better stop right there before I get thrown in the doghouse. So ladies and gentlemen, let that be your motivation for the day. Whatever's pushing you, use that. And we're going to get in this gym and train because I might be in the dog. All right, look at him go. Got the hat on backwards. You know, most people don't know this, but that, that's, that's, that's what really builds the muscle right there is when you put your hat on backwards, it stimulates the muscle. All right, you got this. Told you all Wearing the hat backwards, that's what does it. That's what builds the muscle. Here we go with James sticking with it. This man is five weeks into the training, ladies and gentlemen, and he's still going strong. Look at him go. Something's got him very motivated. Ladies and gentlemen, he may not be Tony Stark, but he is definitely Iron Man. Go, Lamont, go! Just a little different variation on the road, ladies and gentlemen. You're going to want to hit this one for three sets of 10 to 12 reps. Keep it nice and wide. It really puts some tension on that scapular area of your back, and you're going to be burning by the time you're done with this. Make sure you give a full extension, pull to the belly button, keep your chest up. Here go James, he's doing his grip a little closer. You know, he's kind of new to some of these different training methods, so he took his grip a little closer, he still felt that burn, and he's getting his reps in. Next, I'm doing a little bit of a modified bent over row because they've got that little thing that elevates you off the ground important key with this ladies and gentlemen is your form do not round your back do not round the back i'm going to take a tip from my trainer and yours mr lamont and that goes on back oh god ladies and gentlemen he's hoping oh this ain't even going to make it this will not make the video. I'm putting on the hat of winners. <laughs> Notice the thumb backwards. That's, that's how you build muscle. 
Man, you a cold brother. Three sets of eight to ten on this one. Keep your form right, ladies and gentlemen. Keep your form. It's important on this exercise that you do it with great form. This is one I learned from a pro bodybuilder to give yourself a little bit of width. You just pull across the body. Keep your chest up and pull as hard as you can coming across that body. And you're going to want to hit this one for 8 to 12 reps, whatever is good for you. Here we see my man James hitting the opposite side of what I did. Ladies and gentlemen, you're going to hit both sides with this exercise. Just keep it up. Stretch it all the way at the top and pull down at the bottom. It's going to be a good stretch. If you've never done this before, look out. It's going to be sore. We ended on some pullovers for the back. This gives you some overall back wideness. And take this one for a higher rep count, ladies and gentlemen. You want to go 12 to 15 reps on this one. Bend your knees a little bit. Stretch all the way up. Lock in your L, your fore, I mean your wrists, and squeeze down. Squeeze it all the way down. Nice squeeze. And this will really, really hit that back, and you'll be sore from this. You're going to go three sets, 12 to 15 on this, ladies and gentlemen. Three sets of 12 to 15 reps. Post exercise, what do you got to say? How do you feel about the workout today? Every workout hurts, but I feel good today. I would much rather hurt my arms and in my back than my legs. I am still recovering from leg day. This is two days later, and I'm doing that thing right now where when you walk up the stairs, you have to grab onto a pant leg and like lift your leg up and go up one stair at a time. I am still recovering on leg day, but my arms hurt too now, so I got I got the whole thing going on. All right. It was a good workout though. Yeah, good one. Yeah. All right, you two, that was our back workout. As you see, my man James is still hurting from legs the other day. Now, if y'all don't want to hear me sing anymore, I want y'all to stay motivated. If you don't want to hear these golden pipes no more, I want you to think about my sad voice the next time you're ready to cheat on your diet, the next time you're ready to slow down your progress on your goals. But in the meantime, don't forget to like my video, comment, and subscribe. Go get yourself a life gain. Hit me up at www.facebook.com forward slash life gains 07. We'll see you in the next video. Yeah, it's the king.